You don't like it. There's no back on it as well. And you could fall back. Well, I could fall anyway. Especially <laughs> <laughs> after the carry on last night. But anyway. <laughs> Oh, I won't fall, I promise. All right, let's switch hands. Hold this one right up here by this now. Yeah. All right, so let's do this. Take a deep breath. Close your eyes. You don't have to close your eyes out here, but you close your eyes. And I want you to feel this high chair that you're on. As a matter of fact, if you have any high chair experiences in your past, go with one of those. If you don't have any, make one up. Make it really bother you. Feel the high chair. You were so kind to bring two chairs up that we'll never use for you. <laughs> feel this high chair thing. You got it? Oh, Jesus, I'm about to fall off this chair. <laughs> anyway. All right, feel the feeling falling off. What happens if you going to fall off to? Big heap on the floor. Yeah. Make a big spectacle of yourself. Mm -hmm. All right. Does this really bother you? Right? I yes, hate high chairs. Yes, it does, yeah. Say it again, I hate high chairs. I hate high chairs. Zero, I don't hate it. Ten, I really do. How strong do you hate it? Ten. Can you make it more than a 10? 100. Do it. 100. You feel it? Hate it? yeah. Inside your body, where do you feel this hatred at? Just very uncomfortable. Uncomfortable? Can you make the yeah. uncomfortable feeling worse? As a matter of fact, as of today, you realize that Ireland passed a new law, no regular chairs, only high chairs everywhere. <laughs> I'd be lying down then. All right, feel the high chair feeling, you got it? Yeah. All right, notice in your body. Notice anything that you may feel. In your mind, do this. Imagine in front of you a tree. Can you see one? A tree, yeah. Right. I just pulled all the roots out from under. Naturally, what will happen to a tree without roots? It's going to topple over. It's going to topple over? Everybody tap with me. Say exactly as I say. Say, I release and let go. I release and let go. All my sadnesses. All my sadnesses. I release and let go. I release and let go. All my fears. All my fears. I release and let go. I release and let go. All emotional traumas. All emotional traumas. Angers. Angers. Guilt. Guilt. Helpless feelings. Helpless feelings. Feelings of no control. Feelings of no control. Fear of falling. Fear of falling. Shame. Shame. Humiliation. Humiliation. And everything else. And everything else. I'm safe to let it go. I'm safe to let it go. Along with that headache. Along with the headache. Take a deep breath. Say peace. 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 Right now, you're on this high chair. I want you to feel the fear. I hate high chairs. Zero to ten. How strong is this hatred? Still don't like them. How strong do you hate it? I want you to hate it. I don't know. I just don't like the chair. How do you know you don't like it? Just they're uncomfortable. Right. Uncomfortable. Uncomfortable. I sense them, but. Sensitive to everything. Everything so sensitive. <laughs> everything so sensitive. So uncomfortable. So uncomfortable. Those hard chairs are more are more comfortable. But the chair with the back on is so comfortable. Let it go. Peace. Peace. Feel this hatred for this chair. High chairs everywhere. Can you feel the hatred? Yeah. I think I know why you don't like it now, because you're more exposed up in the high chair. Yeah, you are more exposed. Everybody's seeing you. Yeah. I'm vulnerable. I'm vulnerable. I'm exposed. I'm exposed. I'm vulnerable. I'm vulnerable. They can see me. They can see me. I can't hide. I can't hide. I release and let it go. I release and let it go. Deep breath. Peace. Peace. Right. You're on a high chair. You're exposed. You're vulnerable. Is that feeling still there? Kind of issue was there. I'm going to miss those vulnerable feelings. I'm Say, going to miss those vulnerable feelings. Being exposed. Being exposed. No back. No back. Nothing to lean on. Nothing to lean on. Nowhere to hide. Nowhere to hide. A spectacle in front of the class. A spectacle in front of the class. I should be an actress. I should definitely be an actress. And I'm okay without a back. And I'm okay without a back. <laughs> Peace. Peace. All right, again, aren't you, you're in this high chair, aren't you? Yes. I want you to hate this high chair. Can you do it? Yeah. yeah. How strong is your hatred? Zero to ten. It was higher than a ten. How strong is it? I don't know. I still don't like the chair. How do you know you don't like it? It likes you. <laughs> <laughs> Say it likes me. It likes me. And I'm rejecting it. And I'm rejecting it. I know that feeling of rejection. I know that feeling of rejection. Poor chair. Poor chair. Poor me. 
Pour me. Let it go. Peace. Peace. You're in this high chair and it loves you. Now I can't love it. Are you sure? Yes, I'm certain. Now you really hated this chair before you started, isn't that true? Yeah, definitely. Do you definitely hate the chair now? Might be a bit more harmless, but... There is something that could harm you with it, right? Yeah. What is it? I think... I'm not sure. But you can feel it. Yeah. I release that feeling. Really that wherever it came from. Wherever it came from. It's safe for me to let it go. It's safe it's for me to let it go. Even if I am a bit stubborn. Even if I am a bit stubborn. That poor chair. That poor, poor chair. Poor me. 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 Poor How does it feel to be here? I want you to really hate it. Can you hate it? Yeah, well, I can hate it a bit less, I guess. You hate it some? Yeah. Like zero to ten. It was a higher than a ten, not zero yet. How do you know you hate it? Well, I wouldn't, if I could stand instead of being on it, I would prefer to stand. But I would have you sit instead. Because it says princess on top of the seat, you know that. No. <laughs> That's the last thing it says anyway. Let it go. Let it go. I have no control. I have no control. They're always controlling me. They're always controlling me. The chairs. The chairs. The teachers. The teachers. Innocent, nice Robert. Innocent, nice Robert. <laughs> Trying to help me heal. Trying to help you. Me heal. Me heal. Let go of that headache. Let go. Peace. Peace. All right, again, you're in this chair. I just hate this chair. Say it again. I hate I, this I chair. I hate this chair. Say it with love and passion. I hate this chair. I hate this chair. Is that true? Well, I don't hate it that much. <laughs> <laughs> well, as much as that. Say, I let it go. I let it go. I forgive that chair. I forgive the chair. That sweet, innocent chair. The sweet, innocent chair. Who supported a lot of people. Who supported a lot of people. And I'm okay to let it go. And I'm okay to let it go. Deep breath. I hate that chair. Come on. I hate that chair. It's right. too much about the chair. But anyway. All right, think about the chair. And by the way, you go home, and guess what's everywhere? Bar stools everywhere, and you said, "Where the furniture goes?" And oh, we got all these bar stools. What do you think about that? Well, I got rid of all the bar stools when we bought the house. There was a load of bar stools. I got rid of them. <laughs> Came now you have to my brother, and I met them all in his house there recently, and I thought, "Oh God, those chairs!" <laughs> see those? See those chairs? Oh, oh God. yeah. Oh God, those chairs! Yeah, those awful chairs. Those awful, wonderful chairs. Yeah, awful. Reminds me chairs. of my own shit. Oh yeah, loads of shit. Loads of shit, let it go. Yeah. It's all the bar stools. It's all the bar stools. If it hadn't been for bar stools, I'd have no problems. If it hadn't been for bar stools, I'd have no problems. <laughs> Deep breath. Peace. Peace. Are right, you at your brother's house and look at those beautiful bar stools? Yeah, they are nice. <laughs> they no, they are nice bar stools, but I don't like them. They are nice. But now they're in your home. Your husband decided to reclaim it. Oh no, no, I don't know. Get them out. No, no. What is it about bar stools? How's your head doing anyway? The attention has gone off my head after the stools. Well, go back to your head. Get the headache. Yeah, the headache is getting better. I'm sorry to hear that. Can you make your headache? Make your headache come back. Remember this morning you had a big, big time headache, and and your brother said, "Well, just tap on it." Yeah. You remember the pain in your head? Yeah, I do. I release the pain. I release the pain. I'm such a pain. I'm such a pain. It's, it's a all pain. in my head. It's all in my head. With the bar stools. With the bar stools. Let it go. Peace. Peace. Right this morning you had a headache, isn't that right? Yeah. How does it feel to have a wonderful headache? Yeah. To have a wonderful headache? Yeah, you should have one now. Have one. It doesn't feel great. You remember a really bad headache? Yeah. Can you remember that day? Yeah, I feel like getting sick. Yeah, you can feel it now? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Kind of. That sick feeling, there we go. 
they sick be like the bar stool sick be like I think there's Tylenol on top of the bar stool yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. okay. peace that headache remember that sick feeling when you get sick and the headache mm -hmm. can you remember where you feel it at where I feel it uh -huh. you mean in what room in or my, in my head in your head or in your body Okay. Yeah. Where's it at? It's kind of all here. Oh, good. Yeah. I don't know how to see the world. I don't know how to see the world. I don't know how to process what I'm seeing. I don't know how to process. What I don't I'm want seeing. to see what I've been seeing. I don't know. I don't want to see. What I don't I've know been how seeing. my future will be. I don't know how my future will be. I release and we we'll let it go. I release and we let it go. Just let it go. Let it go. Deep breath. Peace. Peace. Right, that, that headache across your eyes, is it there? No, it's not as bad anyway. No, it's not. Notice what's left. How much is left? Notice it. I release and let it go. I release and let it go. It's safe to let it go. Safe to let it I'm going to miss that headache. I'm going to miss that headache. I hope it comes back again. <laughs> I hope it comes back again. Come on, same with passion. I hope it comes back. I hope it comes back again. Means, at least I have problems. At least I have problems. I'll know who I am then. I know I am the lady with problems. A lady with problems. Let it go. <laughs> you know, she said it earlier, so I don't want to lose all my problems. I may lose my identity. <laughs> okay, here you go. Headache today. Do you have a headache right now? Um, no, not really. Not really. That's sad, no. isn't it? Who are you? Um, are you I'm oh, good. You didn't lose your identity. I, was, <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> Say, oh, uh, Susan. No, I don't want to be Susan. Okay, good. Right. Are you on the bar stool again? Yeah, I'm definitely still on the bar stool. How's that feel? It doesn't feel great. I'm at the lower back. Yeah, there's pressure in the lower back. Isn't yeah, it? for it to light up. Yeah. And this lower pressure, right? Really low? Mm hmm. Yeah. So I just need someone to support me. I just need someone to support me. Emotionally support me. Emotionally support me. Intellectually support me. Intellectually support me. Give me a chair and I'm supported. Give me a chair and I'm supported. Let it go. But you did definitely hate bar stools, didn't you? Can you hate one now? I can like it a small bit because it has that foot thing. It's <laughs> <laughs> a small bit. <laughs> yeah, truly. It's a small bit of support. There you go. Yeah. See, there's always support there. You just weren't paying attention. See, there's always support in my life. There's always support in my life. I just hadn't been paying attention. I just hadn't been paying attention. Too busy feeling abandoned. Too busy feeling abandoned. And alone. And alone. I am supported. I am supported. Even when I was alone. Even when I was alone. I released that feeling of being alone. I released that feeling of being alone. And I am supported. And I am supported. I have a great family. I have a great family. Who love and care for me. Who love and care for I me. I have a great, great bar stool underneath me. I have a great bar stool <laughs> underneath me. And they can handle me. And they can totally handle me. And I'm okay. And I'm okay. Be ready. Peace. Peace. Right. I hate bar stools. That's true, isn't it? Yeah, well, hate now is just kind of strong. Right? I, I, I tolerate. Bar tolerate bar stools. Once you say, I love bar stools. Love bar stools. Put it with a little bit of heart and passion in it. I you do it like this. Go. I love bar stools. <laughs> <laughs> like that. I love bar stools. All right, let me help you. It's okay to love bar stools. It's great to love bar stools. They'll never love me though. They never love me though. They don't have a heart. They don't have a heart. Just four legs. Just four legs. And some way to support me. And some way to support me. Deep breath. Deep. All right, say it again. I yes. love bar stools. I love bar stools. With cookies. With cookies, definitely. <laughs> yeah, they, they make all the difference. And peace. All right. All right, you came up, you did have a headache, right? Mm -hmm. Do you have one? No, it's diverted. No. Diverted? <laughs> no. Do you have a toe ache now? A toe? No, no. Okay, no. good. My toe right. is fine. What about bar stools? Do you really hate them or are they just okay? They're grand. I tolerate them. <laughs> okay, good. Give her a hand. Oh. <laughs> uh, right. What did you notice? Anything you notice that has started? Yeah, from the head to her low back and 
pains in her lower back. Yeah. What else did you notice? You notice that the first thing she came up and she said she hated something. Mm -hmm. And that's where I went first. The, you, the, most, the, the most intense? Uh, the most intense. And also when I'm doing the tapping, the key to healing is, is first of all, owning up and stepping in and feeling it. So I first thing I do is I have them feel it as much as I can. And then I'm using what I call the quick tap, which is I set up with a tree metaphor. If you had a tree in front of you, pull the roots out, what happens? What we're doing is we're telling the unconscious mind how we're going to make the changes. She doesn't even know why I even do that. It doesn't even make sense.